Hi, let's export this simple cinematic scene as MP4 video in Unreal Engine 5. Step 1 is to go to Window Cinematics and select Movie Render Queue. If you don't have this option, you need to enable the plugin. Go to Edit, Plugins, type in Movie Render Queue, over here enable the plugin. And restart the engine. Now go again to Window Cinematics and select Movie Render Queue. Over here, click on the plus button and select your sequence. This is the same sequence that you created with Sequencer. Open drawer with control space and double click the sequencer to open it. If you're a beginner and want to learn how to use basic cinematic camera and sequencer, check out this video. The link is in the description and on the card on the right side. Click on the settings, click plus button and select command line encoder. When you open it, you may see an error message stating that no encoder executable has been specified. To resolve this, we need to specify the encoder software for Unreal Engine. Step 2 is to download and install the free and open source software called FFmpeg. Visit ffmpeg.org and download the Windows option. Select the first result, download to the folder you like. Extract the downloaded file and place it in a location on your computer that Unreal Engine can access. Step 3 is to connect FFmpeg library with Unreal Engine. Go to Edit, Project Settings, under Plugins section, find the Movie Pipeline CLI encoder. Enter the path to the FFmpeg executable by copying the file path from the bin folder where you place FFmpeg. Okay, if I said FFmpeg one more time, I will, I will, I don't know. Paste the path in the executable path field and make sure to include the file name ffmpeg.exe, of course. Afterwards, specify the codec information. For MP4, use this for the video codec and this for the audio codec. Don't forget to set the output file extension to be MP4. And the final step is to render our movie, close the settings window and return to the movie render queue. You can see that the error message is gone. You can adjust additional settings like quality and make sure to enable these delete source files to delete image sequences after the render is complete. Go to output tab, over here choose the output directory and you can change the output resolution. When ready, hit render local and wait for the process to finish. I hope you find this tutorial helpful. Drop some comments below or subscribe to get notified about a new tutorial every week. And be sure to take it slow, don't worry and keep learning because Unreal Engine is awesome. See you in some other video, bye bye.